I mean, you were promoting your last album, you wore the world's first flying dress. <laughs> I have to laugh. <laughs> Lady, can you show me a hidden talent? No. No. I said no. Come on, say, oh! Can I just touch this? No. Oh. Oh. No. No. Will it move if I did? No. Okay, it's just not allowed. No. Okay. Why did you decide to match the hair to the dress? Why not? Do the nails match? No. Oh, wait. Very similar. Very similar. I wanted, I wanted to go with like an almost ballet slipper color. They were out at my nail salon. They were out of ballet slipper? Yeah. Who's ever out of ballet? Sorry. <laughs> I took the last one. <laughs> Uh, once ate a Barbie doll's head during a concert. Yes, all the time. No, that's not true. That is that's true. true. That's not true. Why are you asking me to... Wait, that's poison you. That's polypropylene. I'm just so fed up with all of this. Flavor is immaculate. 10 out of 10. We'll eat again. No, 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 no. That's, that's, no, that's not what you that's think. Delicious. No, no, it's... No sleep. Bus, club, another club, another club, plane, next place, no sleep, no fear. And then I've been inquired, there's someone who said that um, uh, Lady Gaga is actually a very well endowed young man. Right. Then, <laughs> but that is well, a... I do have a really big talk <laughs> there, there will be a, a new president, and it could be Donald Trump. <laughs> I have nothing to say of him. Some people want to win races. Other people want to be president of the United States and change people's lives. <laughs> yeah, I, let me rattle them off. Talented, brilliant, incredible, amazing, show-stopping, spectacular, never the same, totally unique, completely not ever been done before, unafraid to reference or not reference, put it in a blender, shit on it, vomit on it, eat it, give birth to it. He's all those things. There can be a hundred people in the room and 99 don't believe in you. But I had this one incredible talent with me. There can be a hundred people in the room you can and have 99 people don't believe in you. There can be a hundred people in the room and 99 don't believe in you. There can be a hundred people in the room and 99 don't believe in you. There can be a hundred people and there can be in one room, right? And 99 don't believe in you, but just one believes. And it can change your whole life. I probably said this earlier, but there can be... And 99 hundred people don't believe in you. Final question from the fans. Describe the Countess in three words. I'm very hungry. That'll do. Bye, bitch. <laughs> I'm an, I have an interesting mind, but I want to smell like a slut, to be totally honest. <laughs> yeah, that's going to happen one day, darling. Well, they better open up the gate. There's 3,000 people standing in my line, and nobody's standing in your line. Who's going to hell? We're going to talk about this amazing dress. Thank you so much. Oh, it's phenomenal. I understand it was inspired by Judy Garland. Is this true? Oh. Look. You know what? I don't... I... We didn't say that. Uh, no, but it, it looks an awful lot like that, it doesn't does, it? It does, doesn't it? Gaga. Yes. How were you as a patient and how is it to be back? I was so excited to rejuvenate my body. Exciting in a way, you feel like an infant. Yeah. But in another way, I felt all the time. Hello, Lady Gaga. Hi, Grandma, how are you? And we matched today, we're both in pink. No, oh yeah, it's clever. Nice sock. It's clever. <laughs> I noticed that you, before you speak to me, you 
drop your eyes and center yourself. Uh, I like to just make sure that I give you my full attention and it's a lot of noise around me. And what the fuck? I've learned working with Marina. Did you hear the creaking door? Yeah. Who's coming in? Who's coming out? It's like a ghost. This is from Robert in Northern Ireland. If you could be anyone for a day, who would you be and why? Does it have to be a person? I'd like to be the moon. What? I would imagine you could see a lot if you were the moon. Yeah. A lot of things things happen at night time. A void of vanity. And so, and as the blood rushed out of my body, um, I explain it. You know, dangerous things and horror relaxes me. It really freaks out my friends a lot. He comes home and I'm watching like either that or you know some slasher film where someone's head's getting decapitated. And I'm like, Alibi. you have you have theater, you have uh, this this discipline, this meditative performance discipline, and then you have uh, a commercial art that's viable as fine art. And these are all the sorts of things that I'm very interested in. Don't be nervous. I'm really Slightly normal. Gargle. <laughs> I'm shockingly you normal. You are. Before we go any further, I think we should bless this interview. We should. The father, father the son, and the house, and the house of Gucci. And yep. I have to do it in natural light, because if we don't have natural light everywhere, I can't see the exact color, right. pigmentation, shine, pearl, shimmer, sparkle, all of it. All of the stuff. So, the number one thing I hate when people go, oh, you're just wearing makeup because you're insecure. No. No. That's not a nice you're thing You're wearing to do. a hat because you have a receding hairline, sir. Yeah, that's rude. Same thing. Don't do that. Mm -mm. No. Are, are you scared, though, that uh, <laughs> <laughs> sexual references, can it undermine the music? Because the sex, sexual references... Uh, <laughs> I'm not scared. Are you scared? No. <laughs> Because I'm not scared. No? Because you're not worried that they'll um, just uh, check out the sexual references and not care about the music? No. Not at all. I've got three number one records and I've sold almost four million albums worldwide. <laughs> so what's the biggest thrill of your career so far? The gay community. Oh, wow. Why? Can you? Because they don't ask me questions like that. You're so creative. Where do you get your inspiration? Um, God and the gays. You're the best fans in the whole world, and I love you. And it's for God and for the gays. Yeah! Wait a minute. Hold on. God and for the gays. You actually thanked God and the gays. Who do you thank more, God or the gays? I thank them both equally um, because uh, they made one another. Period! To God and the gays. Congratulations! That's my mama. You got to tweet. You can do whatever. That's my mama. And you can tweet till you get blue in the face. I don't care. She can have whatever she wants because that's my mama.